You hear that, viewers? The sound of the wind blowing. The winds of change. Welcome back, everybody, to Octopath Traveler. I'm your host, the Musical Gamer. We're here in Still Snow. We're about to go embark on a particular quest of primroses. We're going to a whorehouse. Don't don't ask me why this is a thing. It's a thing. But the uh, the man with the crow tattoo is holed up here. In fact, he owns the place. Lady Primrose. That man there is Orin. He drives the carriage. Well, thanks, Ariana. We happen to run into her. Old friend. Turned out she's a whore. He has a sharp eye and a suspicious nature. That's why he was hired. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm Primrose. I wish you a pleasant evening, sir. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> haven't seen you around here before. You a new girl? Mm -hmm. I am. This will be my first night in the Master's service. Well, no one's told me about it, so you ain't getting in my carriage. I see. Cautious indeed. Well, what do we do? How do we pull the wool over his eyes, so to speak? Do we allure him with our feminine wiles? In that case... You know, before I came here, I was a dancer. Men said that once they'd seen me on the stage, nothing could ever satisfy them again. Would you like a little show? Huh. Is he falling for it? I think you'll find it most... stimulating. Huh. Well? Is he gonna take the bait? I think not. You do Oh, crap. Okay. He's, uh... Hmm, I am. Did you not enjoy it? <laughs> Alright. He's either he's either one of the most strong-willed, nerves of steel type of person, or he's gay. I mean, it can only be one of no. those two options. Seen better. Seen worse, I reckon. If you'll excuse me. Dude! I see... Then, do not allow me to trouble you further. Ow, you just, like, wounded her pride. Jesus. <laughs> what do we do? Lady Primrose. It was a most beautiful dance, my lady. Oh, shove it. Thank you. Thank you, Ariana, but your praise is not the prize I sought. <laughs> we sought something else. <laughs> oh, you, you can clearly tell. I did try to warn you, my lady. The man is no fool. Fine, then. Indeed. I must find another way. Well, alright then. What do we do? We should go back and talk with Ariana. Perhaps there's something in someone in town who could convince Orin to change his mind. we Allure someone who can sway Orin. Well, can we learn a little bit more about you, Orin? Mm. Hmm. Who can we talk to? He owes the tavern keeper a debt. What sort of debt I couldn't say. Really now? Okay, well, let's go talk to the tavern keeper. You! Good sir. Well, my traveler, what can I do you for? Hold on. Wait. We can allure him. 100% chance to succeed. Would you get her to spend a little more time with me? You want me to have a word with Orin? Uh, yes. I'll think about it. Pray come hither. <laughs> okay, though, there, there seemed to be a disconnect there. <laughs> That's uh, not at all what Prim should have said to the guy, but whatever. Hey, dude, we brought somebody you know. M Master Barkeep. It was a pleasure to see my kind benefactor. What brings you here? You want me to give the new girl a ride? Hmm. Well, what's it gonna be, big guy? Uh, I mean, of course, sir. As you wish. At least I can do to repay your kindness. Hop in, woman. We don't have all night. <laughs> you watch your tone with me. I will stab you in the back. I'll take this carriage for myself. Fine. Well, at least that seemed to work. That was a, that was a really quick solution. 
Eh, all right. Well, I mean, I'm not complaining. I, I, what was the point of that? If, if it was literally just walking five feet over and alluring the guy, what was that just for flavor? I mean, at least it was easy. I didn't have to go out of my way to do something, you know, stupid and pointless. But still, it's like, what was the point? Primrose. Father, please, let me try just once more. You have tried enough. Now you must be still and reflect upon why you continue to fail. You are my daughter, the lone daughter of House Azelheart. You must be strong, stronger than you are now. What do you mean, dear old dad? Yes, father. What was she trying to do? Dance? Answer me this, Primrose. What is required of the head of a great house? The Lady of House Azelheart? The Lady of House Azelheart must safeguard her family's success and glory. She must be strong enough that no other house might overshadow our own. Ah, inner house okay, politics. Answer. But hear me well, Brimrose. Worth is not found in the eyes of others. That which truly matters most lies within. What the head of our house must value above all is faith. Faith. Faith in what? Faith shall be your shield. These are our house words. And what they mean is that you cannot waver until you have done what you know in your heart of hearts must be done. So faith in ourselves, I guess. It is the determination to keep your eyes fixed on the path before you. Though a thousand indignities may seek to trip you up along the way. You must find that faith in yourself. Yes, father. Hmm, sort of like a uh, internalization of, of affairs kind of Primrose, thing. I would entrust this dagger to you. Oh, the dagger. Our words are engraved upon the blade. See that they are engraved upon your heart as well. I mean, I guess this makes sense why Prim, as a dancer, only wields a dagger. <sighs> Makes sense for her character. Lady Primrose, are you all right? What'd you do? Fall asleep? Ariana, you must have been very weary. I, I was just thinking about Father. Even in my memories, he will not stop lecturing me on how to live my life. Sounds like a parent. Azelheart was a man of unwavering principles. An unwavering parent. That he was. <laughs> He taught me the sword, he taught me my letters, he taught me what it meant to live with dignity and honor. <laughs> he taught me all that I know. He always told me, choose wisely what to believe in and have faith in your beliefs, for that faith shall be your shield. What do I believe in? I don't know, Prim. Only you can answer that. Your father seemed like a very interesting individual. I mean, you know, waxing poetic all the time like that. My lady. End of the line. Oh. Hello. Where are we now? I'm sure we're at the brothel, but... Here we are. This is where I take my leave. And not a word of this to the man in charge. I don't know who you are, but I know you don't belong here. Well, okay. I won't say anything if you won't. Hmm. Once long ago. House Hazelheart was locked in a vicious struggle with several of the other high houses. The tales say that my forebears dir dirtied their hands with many inglorious deeds in those days. One time, the head of House Hazelheart invited his liege lord to the castle for a great feast. Only to murder him and every last man in his party to seize power for himself. Damn! <sighs> Shit, your, uh, your ancestors were cold! That's right. This lord had been a cruel man 
and perhaps my forebear did the common folk a great service. But it did not win him any friends. Still, my family never relinquished the power they had seized, and they never lost faith in their convictions. Faith shall be my shield. Unwavering belief in the righteousness of what they had done protected them from any slings and slights. Did it? <laughs> the petty squabbles of great houses concern me no longer. But our words still guide me, as they have guided my family for so long. As long as I have something to believe in, this is all I need. Lady Primrose, what is it that... Lady Primrose, what is it that you believe in? Ariana swallowed the question, her words hanging in the air. She feared what the answer might be. I have a feeling Prim's answer is going to be something along the lines of she believes in vengeance. That ain't a good way to live your life. We all see how that turns out to everybody who what tries to follow that path. Did you say something, Ariana? No. It's nothing, my lady. Lady Primrose. This is the Obsidian Parlor. The dark rumors about it never cease, yet it remains cloaked in shadow. They say men of influence from across the realm have their hands in the buying and selling of women here. <clears throat> Jesus. I do not like this place. Can we burn it? I want to burn it. Please let me burn it. I've plied my trade here for several years now. You've been... Damn! In that time, many of the girls who came here have disappeared as suddenly as they came. Yes, I am a whore. And a cheap one at that. Sold to this place for a price that would not buy you a good horse. Who knows when I will be sold again? And to wear for another pittance. When I think of that. It, it scares me. I'm sorry. Forgive me, Lady Primrose. I do not deserve your pity. Oh, man, Ariana. Make your way through this cave. Through a cave? Oh, of course, through a cave. Of course, it's always a cave. God damn it, why can't I just walk through the front door? Well, then again, we've done that twice now, haven't we? Ravis's Manor and the Mance of Morlock's Mance. That, that didn't seem to go so well. So, okay, maybe a cave is good. We'll take you to the Master's Chambers if you go quietly. No one will be the wiser of your coming. But Lady Primrose, do be careful. I must be getting to work. So this is where I must leave you. Thank you. Of course, Ariana. Thank you for all you have done. Take care of yourself and have faith. Well, there we go. God, what? <laughs> the kind of shit that drives a person to to sell themselves like that, I I can't even fathom it. <laughs> Why so grim? Grim? You look like a tiger about to pounce on its prey. Maybe I am. I've been hunting for a long time now. Well, just make sure the hunter doesn't become the hunted. Don't worry about me. I know what I'm doing. When I set a goal, I always achieve it. I'm not the sort of to forget their lines at the show's finale. I'll take your word for it. But I appreciate your concern. I didn't realize you cared so much. I know. I'm so thoughtful. <laughs> Very in. It's just like, I know. I'm so thoughtful. That smug bastard. Oh, I love him so. All right, the secret path. So, let me guess. We're probably... Yeah, we're up over here. I had a feeling this is the brothel. I was looking at the map earlier. I'm like, this... This looks like the place we're supposed to go to. Oh, jeez. All right, well, we will take this team with us, and I think we'll stick with it. It's a good mix of stuff. Um, 
Let's come... Yes, down here. We did miss a chest back there. I'll have to go get. Shadow Soul Stone. Do, 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 do. Don't mind me. Coming down the stairs. Do it. Oh! Whoa, what the hell is that thing? What are you? A light guardian? Excuse me? I have no idea what the hell that thing is. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, that's a light sentinel. I get the feeling they're probably going to be weak to dark. I don't know why. It's just that feeling I get. You know, it's that little niggling feeling in the back of your mind. bring your shade. Yep, both of them are. Makes sense. Let's do this. Um, right. You have cleric skills now, don't you? Hmm. Let's do some tray tempest though. Ah, those guys are weak to wind. Good. Good to know. Um, go, Lind, go. These guys over here are weak to swords as well. Let's do this. Good to see anybody here weak to uh, we can try some light here. Anybody here weak to light? Luminous. Some luminescence? No, no, no light takers. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, how about some? Uh, I have many options with you. Let's try some uh, some bows. Why are we see if you're weak to bows? You are weak to bows. Huzzah! <laughs> we figured that out. Uh, how about some, uh, how about some spear? Ah, they are weak to spears, and so is the, uh, light Sentinel. All right, good to see. Get another light night out going. No death, no death. Multi- Ooh, ow. What the hell? What's this? Whoa, what are you doing? I do, n I do not appreciate that. Let my hmm. arrow fly Interesting. True. Um, I think Primrose is affected with that status ailment that doesn't let her charge her BP. I think that's what that is. It's holding back nothing. Well, there goes those two. And these two are left. My turn now. Anybody here weak to staves? Uh -huh. Yes, you actually are. My turn. I just wanted to check. Nope, not weak to axes. Yes, you are, in fact. Okay. That's fair. That's fair. We'll break you, though. Wow, Prim, your magic ain't doing too hot right now. I could have sworn you you did tons of damage the first time around. What the hell happened? Uh. You're broken. Let's try some fire. Yes. Just curious to test a couple of different things, see if we can Let's find out what the weak to. Hmm. Weak to bows. No, you're not weak to bows back there. Yeah, we're, like, doing nothing. Ah, uh, cleric skills. Do we do some, uh, healing? Might have to. I don't know. Uh, how about we just some Trade Tempest? Let's see if we kill somebody here. Ah, oh, we killed the guy in front! Nice. Why should not worry about you? Yeah, I was about to say, I'm like, I don't think you're gonna do too much damage to me. Out of my way. I'm totally honest. And that's that. Indeed, that is that. Ooh, look at that experience. Ooh, baby. That is a good chunk of change right there. I approve. Uh, was that a... I saw a glow. Was that a hidden item? No, it couldn't have been. Could it? Herb of Revival. I'll take that. Oh, uh, that reminds me. I actually did upgrade Hanit's armor back at the shop. I bought her the Snowy Cape and Snowy Hood because they were just just better than what she was currently equipped with. So I figured, no, nah, that seems appropriate, especially for this area. Plus, her having better armor is just it's just better in the long run. I am ready. All right, let's give this another try. Some uh, Night Ode. Night Ode. Bring your shade. Would were wait, whoa, whoa, this is a different dude. My turn. What? A wind guard oh. Okay then. Um Mr. Wind Guardian, what are you weak to? I uh I'd like to see. What to do? Hmm. This is this is not what I envisioned happening right now. 
Ah, crap. Ah, crap, baskets. Ah, uh, th Thunderbird. Okay, you're weak to lightning. Good to know. Oh, you're weak to, weak to daggers. Wait, didn't I try daggers? I thought I did. And swords. Fantastic. Yeah, does he like resist wind or something? No, no, he does not. His resistance is, resistance is, isn't really a thing in this game. That's fine. Uh... Oh my god. Three times, huh? Do I dare? Now, people have told me that Bewildering Grace can potentially, like, increase my job points and EXP gain from battles by, like, a hundred times. Oh, God. Yeah. BP Drowsy. BP Recovered. And BP Recovered. Actually, that was wholly positive right there. Nice. Let my arrow fly I'll, uh, I'll take it. Apparently, these guys are asleep now. wasn't really that useful, but the BP thing is amazing. I capture these guys. Ooh, now hold the phone. I can capture this guy. Mmm. Right. I'm diddly dumb. Alright. I think I shall. Ow. 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 Bring your shade. Well, there we go. They're broken in the back again. My turn now. Uh, Prim, can you possibly catch this guy? Maybe even on this turn? I don't know. We'll find out. Oh no, I killed him! God damn it. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, buddy, are you? I appreciate it. Alright, good. Murdered. What Another next? one dead. Uh, Hunter skill. Wait, no. Beast lore. Capture. 83% chance. Oh, if I boost it, it's 100. What do I get from you? Just oh, luminescence myself and your strength 4. You know what? I think that's worth it, honestly. At least, um, you'll have some ac access to some light magic. Loris the war dog. Um, I guess get rid of the, the Loris. Alright. Strength four. Strength four. Slash mighty slash. You don't know. Get rid of the dog. Mighty slash sounds better. <laughs> I don't know about you. I am ready. There we go. The show Good kill there, Prim. Ooh. 220 experience points. That is nice. Prim actually grew a level. And we got a light soul stone. I will gladly say yes to that. Now let's grab this chest and be on our way. Spiriting plum, medium sized. Sounds good to me. Oh, crap. This is the way forward, isn't it? Going on here. Meanwhile, meanwhile, back at the ranch. <laughs> meanwhile, back at the we brothel. <laughs> God damn it. I beg your pardon, Master Rufus. Pray have mercy and hear my plea. She was only my daughter. I spared no effort in raising her to be a fine lady. Each day I brushed her beautiful hair and dressed her in the finest silks. She... she was everything to me. But then... then she was sullied by the son of a country lordling. Hmm. She could not bear being dishonored so. And on the eve of her wedding day, she took her own life in shame. Whoa! Oh! Oh god! This just got dark. What is it with Prim's shit and it always being horribly dark? I mean, sure! Her father was murdered by three men bearing the mark of the crow! She lived her life as a as a as a pseudo whore, dancing her days away, <laughs> pleasing her master. 
behind the stage curtains. Oh god. What is, what is wrong with this? God damn it, Square! Why? Never again will I stroke my daughter's long, beautiful hair. <laughs> when I think of that, Lord Ling living his days in luxury, with no punishment for his heinous deeds, it keeps me awake, night after sleepless night. Master Rufus, please lend me your strength. Lend me your power, that I might have my vengeance against that sinful house. Hey, Father Escard. We are friends, are we not? B but of course. Meaning, and friends are always there, with a helping hand in times of need. I trust you will lend me your strength when I am in need. You are a bishop in the Order of the Sacred Flame. You have much to offer me. Yes. Anything you wish, Master Rufus. Anything at all. Good. Then it will be my pleasure to help you. You must be lonely after the loss of your precious daughter, Father. I will give you one of my own girls. How about Ariana? She's close to your daughter's age and has a sweet enough disposition. Use her as you like, and I trust you will enjoy her. Oh God! I am. Oh, thank you, Master great. Rufus. Truly, your generosity knows no bounds. Dude, you're a bishop. I mean, I don't know much about this 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 religion of the Sacred Flame, and I'm assuming. This means you don't, priests don't have to have like vows of celibacy or things like that. But dude, what? How is this okay in the eyes of the sacred flame? You're buying another human being. <sighs> Debts are such a tricky business. But one mace must make hay while the sun shines. What the hell? I am. Mmm. 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 Mm. No. Nah. -uh. I am not having any of this right now. This dude is dead. His ass is grass. I'm taking this pomegranate. I'm gonna shove it where the sun don't shine. Ready or not, uh. Here I come. What are you? You look like some horrible alien Nautilus hybrid creature. I don't- I don't like you. Lord Helix, is this you? Is this you in- in- in Octopath form? I'm- I'm quite terrified, to be totally honest. I- I- uh... St st steal SP. Okay. Okay. Oh boy. Oh god. Uh, try- try the wind. No, they- they are- they are not- they are not weak to the wind. The wind does not- does not call them. Uh, how about Lin? Sword? Sword. Nope, not weak to swords. <laughs> Fuck me! What are you weak to? It's not daggers, it's not swords. It's... Please tell me it's darkness. Please be weak to darkness. They are weak to darkness. Good. That's something. Ow. Uh, what are these things called? Oh, light curators. I, I looked at the name. I could have known they were weak to light. Um, how about some, uh, Reign of Arrows? Aha, okay. uh -huh, look at that, they are weak to bows. Well, would you look at that. Time to break them willy-nilly. The Do we have, uh, anybody who uses bows here? No, not really. Hmm. That's kind of unfortunate. Um, let's just use our own... Arrow Storm? No. Let's use our own Reign of Arrows. Rain and arrows up on. I'm ready. Naito, bring your shade. Sweet. Thanks, Prim. Wow, yeah, Out she is way. not really good at the elemental stuff. <laughs> not at all. I appreciate it. That does tons of damage, though. It's good to see. 
Um, let's do some. Let's just heal some wounds. Heal. Lesson the hunt beginning. How about it? You guys weak to access too? No, not weak to access. Oh, second serving, nice. I'm ready. Prim, I'm gonna be totally honest. Yeah, look at that. Your physical attacks are much stronger than your magic attacks. Just, just in general, is that it? It could be because of the way I've kitted her. It could also be because of the um. Oh wait, they're not with the swords. Shit. Hunt beginning. Crap. I didn't mean to do that. I, mean, I, I guess, I guess I did. But I, I, I didn't mean for that to happen. I thought he was gonna be weak to it. Yeah, Prim is going to be a bit more of a physical fighter, using darkness just to break shields and stuff, I think. But you're weak to spears, too. Yep, you are. That you are. Out of my way. Nice, lower to magic attack. Oh my god, how much HP does this guy have? Oh, jeez. Thou didst fight as a coach. All right, fair enough. Level 21 for Therian. Good for you, my thiefy dude. You could use it. Ah, crap, I went the wrong way. I just came from down there. Eh, woof. Oh, well. Uh, here's a purple chest in here. I'm so glad Therian's with me right now. I might just have to keep him with me for the rest of the game at this point. I hate running into chests I can't unlock. And the one character I need is back at camp. You two broke him. <laughs> You've taken a hit. And now you two broke him. Bring your yeah, that really doesn't do much damage. Prim is Coming. definitely better off just Exalt slashing dance. at things with her dagger. Hmm. I guess I'll use, uh... Now, Mighty Slash. That is a multi-targeting move. Ooh. Ooh. Like. Alright. Good hit there, Tressa. Three percent chance. We'll give it another try in a second. Um, but for right now, just steal some SP. Do some decent hits to the guy. We'll weaken him further. Now, what would it be to, to capture you with 3% chance? What would it get? Whoa! Light stream? A whole bunch of... Oh my god. That's a lot of strength. God damn. And you guys would give me darkness. Hmm. Fascinating. Very fascinating. It's at this moment, I really wish Prim had a uh, had a multi-targeting move. Ow! <laughs> Not sunshine. I don't want to see the light. Stop it! It hurts. Oh, god damn it, man! Uh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I suppose we'll just break them all the, uh, the old-fashioned way here. Mine gives us another turn. And let's see about this. Kind of arrows, true strike, underbird. What do I do here? I really want to do rain of arrows. Steal some SP. Hmm? Good. With that guy dead, I think this fight's gonna be a lot more simpler. Just, 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 it's gonna be a lot better. That's another bird dead. That's another bird dead. 
You're probably almost dead. I am ready. Oh, I meant sword. Damn it. The, da the dagger and the sword icons always get me screwed up. Oh, you're weak to axes. Oh, nice to see. Good. Done. Dealt with. Get out of here. Give Tressa this level up. She needs it. Hanit's almost ready to level two. I, again, this might be another good place to grind like two or three levels for every character. Alright, what's in here? It's a spiked vest. That actually sounds like a great piece of equipment for, I think, Tressa specifically. Because, yeah, look at that elemental defense. That is going to be nice. Very, very sexy. Uh, spiked vest, go. Will we just unequip the silver vest? I think so. Who could use the silver vest? This would be good for Hanit in terms of just stats, but she'd lose so much evasion, I think it's not worth it. You already got the silver vest. Everybody already has one. Hmm. Alright, well, on that note, next time on Let's Play some more Octopath Traveler, we'll continue making our way through here in the caves. We're gonna get to that brothel. We're gonna save Ariana from, from this horrible fate. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. Thanks all for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. See you guys then.